All right, so we're now going to move on to Kylie Strom. Uh, Kylie, another big win at home for this team against a tough, you know, first time seeing Gotham this year, tough opponent. Just how do you feel after this match? Yeah, I mean, we just keep it going. <laughs> um, we just are taking one game at a time. Um, Gotham's obviously a really good opponent, um, super fluid, previous champion. So, um, yeah, it feels good. Um, feels great. Awesome, Glenn. Kylie, um, coming into this game, I... I just ask Corey about this, but from your perspective, you know, Gotham has so many attacking threats and so many big names within their you know, midfield and attack. What was kind of uh, your thought process, your approach to, um, you know, keying in on some of those players or was it more just kind of business as usual for you guys? Honestly, just business as usual. Um, we know they're a really talented team, um, have a, like really fluid in their rotations. Um, you really got to be on your toes, head on a swivel at all times and problem solve. But at the end of the day, we just have to stick to our principles. Um, and we did exactly that. Keep going, awesome. Okay. Um, just from, from your perspective, having that early goal from Adriana and, and being able to play with that lead, how much does that kind of take the pressure off of uh, you guys and just being able to kind of have that confidence, being able to move the ball around? Yeah, that's massive. Uh, Gotham's very good at their press. Um, they're a very aggressive team. Um, so we knew the start of the game was really important for us. Um, and we were able to play through them, um, which was really important for us. Um, and then they had to adapt a little bit. Um, so yeah, getting those goals early and then being able to, to defend for our lives in the end um, paid off. Just kind of going off of that with the defending towards the end of the game, you know that you knew, you know, down to nothing they were going to be pushing. What was kind of uh, the thought process going in with, you know, sending so many numbers forward and, um, you know, just getting the ball out as, as quick as possible? Yeah, at halftime, you know, we say it all the time, 2-0 is a very dangerous lead. Um, so we knew they were going to change something. We weren't sure what. So um, we just needed to, to problem solve and adapt and, you know, try and figure out how to beat the press in the second half. Uh, we were under a lot of pressure, um, but we bend, we don't break. Congrats, Kylie. Quick question. So one goal allowed, it looks like, in the last six league matches. Just an incredible run. So congratulations on that as well. Uh, you talked about those defensive principles. Are there any specifically to you as a defender that are like your bread and butter or that work tonight at the highest level? I mean, I think we just take a lot of pride in our defending. And when we say defending, it's not just our back line or goalkeeper. It's front to back. Um, so we just want to make things predictable. Um, we want to lock them to one side. We want to end it when it gets wide. Um, and when we do that, we have a lot of success. Anything else? Go on. Talk a little bit about the press that Gotham was employing. What was kind of the, the mindset going into playing out at the back? And, uh, you know, as you usually do, just playing calmly and playing, you know, through the ground rather than just kicking it out? Yeah, I think for us, um, we kind of we have a lot of options uh, when it comes to our playing style. Obviously, we can go direct and play in behind with our speed that we have, and we also have players who want the ball at their feet and can get out of really tough situations. So I think just trusting each other and being able to read the situations and what they give us is, is so important. I think that's something we're still working on and developing, but um, I think you can see we're progressing a lot in that area. How beneficial is it to have those those kind of players that are just so confident on the ball that when you're playing out of the back with the press coming that they can take it, make a move, and just open up space completely for the rest of the team? Or, you know, you play it long and you know that they have the speed to run on it. Yeah, it's it's so important. I mean, we've, we've played each other in some really <laughs> tough positions. You know, they have a defender on their back and they still want the ball at their feet, and that's just confidence in themselves, confidence in each other, um, and trust in each other, which is so important. So we just got to keep building that. All right, wrap up there. Thank you, Kylie. Thank you.